Come on. Imagine Teflon doing that. What's up dudes and dudettes? All right, so you're up early. You're looking for breakfast. You're up early mostly because you didn't drink to excess last night and oversleep your alarm and then wondering what you're doing with your life. Don't pay attention to that. That's not for you. All right, so today we're gonna talk about making the perfect egg in a cast iron skillet. Now, a lot of you are gonna have differing opinions on what a perfect egg is. For me, I like, I, I guess it would technically be a fried egg, but I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you the tips and tricks. We got this, we got, th we got this. All right, first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and turn on the heat. Slap it in base. Put it on a nice medium low heat. I throw it on a four. Your range might be different than mine. So get myself a nice little Pyrex dish. You'll understand, you'll understand. Clearly it's about time for me to go shopping because I'm almost out of eggs, but this is enough to do what we're doing here. So the reason I have the Pyrex dish is because I like to crack my eggs into a bowl first. That way if there's any shells or something, hey, maybe you're a better egg cracker than me. Then you don't need the dish, but I need the dish, all right? It's my, com it's my blanket, all right? It's my comfort zone. So I have the dish. <laughs> a beautiful friend of mine uh, suggested that I learn to crack on a flat surface and it, it's changed my life, honestly. The other beautiful thing about cracking all the eggs into a dish is they're all going to cook the same, right? They're all going to be in the pot and the pan the same amount of time. So yeah, that's starting to heat up. So here's what we're going to do. Don't give me shit because my counter's dirty, okay? First thing we're going to do, pour some oil on that thing. That's probably too much, but you know, it is what it is. What is that in the bottom of my pan? You guys are gonna pretend you didn't see that, whatever that was. That is too much oil. So when you guys do this, don't put that much oil in it. What am I doing? I'm gonna get rid of some of this, some of this oil. There we go, that's, that's about the right amount of oil in there. Just enough to make a little sheen on it. Some knob of butter. The butter is really what you want to cook the egg in. The rest of the oil is just to give it like a, you know, make the pan work like Teflon. So nothing will stick. We're going to go ahead and put our eggs in. There we go, yeah. Not too quick of a splatter, but not too slow. There we go. <clears throat> so here's what you're looking for. If you look around the edge, the butter is starting to like fry the edges. You really want to start to get those brown. Now the trick to this is to try to get little crispies around the eggs before the yolks harden. <clears throat> That's where your temperature comes into play. Now if your pan is seasoned well, the eggs shouldn't stick. You know? There we go. Look at that. Come on. Imagine Teflon doing that. Let's cast iron, baby. So this, this kind of crisping, this is what you want, but you want it. Let's try to center this a little more. There we go. So you see we're starting to get the browning around the edge. That's exactly what you want. So we'll go ahead and give a couple of shakes of some pepper. 
and just a little bit of we got it's a rainbow pepper peppercorn you should definitely have that in your kitchen and that was some pink Himalayan sea salt we're getting close here See how this is starting to crisp up? That's exactly what you want. Looking like this side was getting a little more crispy than the other, so I just spun it around. Maybe there's a hot spot happening in my pan. All right, we're really starting to get there. There you have it. See, is it getting all nice and crispy? Look at that. Still runny. See that? We got some crispy in there. That's what you want. Listen, I figure every good southern dude's got to know how to cook in a cast iron skillet. One of the hardest things to cook is eggs because they always stick. So basically the key to it is having a good seasoning on your pan. Could you hear the crunch? I'm telling you, man. Getting those little fried bits on the outside of the egg. Uh, see, that's what you want. Just that one part. The rest of it's not like that. I think I might have cooked the yolks. A little more than I would really would have wanted, but mm. so there you go. So in the morning, you're a little hungover, you need some eggs. There you have it. Super easy. Come on, could it get more easy than that? No, I don't think so. If you like that video, if you want to see more, click the like button. Let me know if this is what you want. Shout out to you guys later. Love it. Ooh.